Hey, fellow collectors, today we're going to be talking about Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Troubles Afoot. This is from Nickelodeon and NECA. So on the front here, we see some foot soldiers. If we open up, we see a lot of accessories here. And we see the mastermind with the other foot behind him. On the side, we have Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Troubles Afoot. And we see some product shots of the Foot Clan. And a little bio about them. Please pause to read. And on the side, we have Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Troubles Afoot from NECA. So if we go ahead and put it on the scale. We see the scales reading 11.4 ounces. So let's get this guy out of the box and see how cool he is. Okay, now that we have this guy out of the package, the first thing I want to say is, you know, we got so much accessories with this. I would have liked to have two Foot Clan robots instead of one with all these accessories. If you would have given us two with some accessories, it would have been great. That would have been awesome. But the first accessory we'll take a look at is this right here. Nifty gun. And we have this futuristic ray gun. We also come with this little handgun here. Have this sword. We have another little ray gun. We come with a officer's hat. Two extra Foot Clan heads. A canister of ooze, a fan, two throwing stars, one orange, one grayish, come with another machine gun. We come with this crane communicator. You can see crane there talking to him. Come with this sword here. And we come with a multitude of hands. So we have 10 extra hands. I don't know how I had, I guess, an extra one in there from another. I have it. Anyway, so we take a look at this. He has Alpha One's head on him. Already switched out. And we can see this is another fine product from NECA. We have the folds for the cloth, which is another nice touch. The bracer guards. The boots. Now as far as articulation, down and up, depending on the head you have, this head will allow a little bit more movement up than this one will. But they both can go left and right without a problem. Now, as far as the arms are concerned, we do get a nice T-pose. 
out of this guy. Oh, that's as far as we can get. Does have a bicep swivel as well as a double bend in the elbow. Wrist rotation with the little lever here. Like back and forth. We do have a waist swivel, no ab crunch. And this guy can do a Von Dom split, no problem. Forward and back, also it's a nice split. Now he does have a little rotation here at the hip for the leg, as well as a double bend in the knee. No boot rotation, yeah, there we go, Ducky boot rotation. Here we go, we have also a ball joint and peg hole with a knee bend and boot tread. So as we get this guy back into shape for a height check, we can see with the Alpha 1 head on, he's coming in right at 7 inches. So that means he will fit in with DC Multiverse figures as well. So it's nice to have this kind of scale for them, even though these guys are just a little bit smaller. So with the plethora of accessories, this guy is loaded down to take some turtles. And he also comes with enough weaponry and it would have been nice, like I said, to have this as just another foot soldier with a, a weapon. Something for people to talk about, think about. The interchangeable heads and everything like that is nice, but for this price point, two soldiers would have been awesome. Alright, so until next time, guys. If you are looking for any kind of collectibles, head on over to EntertainmentEarth.com using the link provided below. And remember, like, subscribe, and keep...